Ephraim YouTube channel. My country people, I greet you now where where. I greet you now where where. Today we will talk the way country man and country woman will understand what the way we do. Today we carry another going topic come. The topic we carry come now how we will take prevent things where they happen for house where if it cause blindness. Accidents where if it happen for house where it will cause blindness. Now here we carry come today. So my people, make we na come closer, make we na draw closer, make we na can hear what you will carry come today. Number one, what you will carry come, be see, he gets some accident where he occur for house. Inside our domot, where if he cause accident, cause accident where he go blind person. And this accident, if he blind small picking, if he blind papa, if he blind mama, eh, make we na come. This accident where they talk now, they plenty, plenty, plenty. Inside clinic here, we will see plenty of them. They can start with small picking them. My picking and picking them are their own. I want to talk first. Eh? Some picking where they go carry pencil. Pencil where will they take go school? You see this pencil where picking they take right for school? You see Byron where picking they take right? This kind by Byron then. And pencil. Then they cause blindness. Then they give us wahala for inside clinic. The wahala where they give us on clinic is too much. Is too much. You go see small picking way one go school. They go carry by the way long pass and give them. Picking way they two years, three years. They go carry very long pencil give them. That pencil way they give them, sometimes it cause blindness. How that pencil will take cause blindness? We could at least make a talk way way. If that picking carry that pencil for hand, you know, put them inside bag. Carry them, you walk out. Sometimes the papa go say, come enter car. As they picking the entire motor, they enter car. And then they go there inside the car, they play with that person, sometimes they enter the eye. Or if the person where they drive the car, match break. As in the match break, now so the person they follow the eye, they go. So many, many things where they inside will cause with it. Blindness. As that person will hit the eye, it will blind the eye. What am I saying in summary? Is that person that our children are using in school can cause blindness because of what? Most time when there is an accident, it can lead to what? Blindness. For example, when they enter the car and the person that is driving that car match break, that person normally hits the eye. Or if the child is running with that pencil or the viral, if the pencil or viral is not inside the bag, it can hit the eye and cause blindness. So how can we prevent this blindness from coming occurring in our in our in our, our children? How we take stop this blindness, make it not destroy the eye of our, our picking them. Number one, what we will do be say that pencil, you go cut them. If not small picking way hand over big, that pencil way long, you use razor, cut them into two. Make it small, make it not enter the eye. And then you go tell the picking, make it they put the pencil inside bag. Especially when they don't enter a car, when they go, go drop them for school or inside their school bus. Because as that car, the quaka, the shape, the shape, the shape, sometimes if a match break, that picking, that pencil will enter the eye. And most cases, we will not see for clinic. If we enter the eye, most time that eye will, water will come out. Because the eye be like nylon bag where they put water inside. So if the pencil hits that eye, the water will then inside eye will pour. Once you don't pour like that, that eye will have to, to help her. So a pencil can cause blindness. Then small picking them, sometimes they carry stick, they walk up and down, long, long stick. If you see picking where you carry stick for hand, picking they like carry stick for hand. That stick where they carry for hand, feel blind them all. That stick, if they they run with that stick and they can't fall, once they fall with that stick where they their hand, what it go happen? That stick feel enter their eye. So if you see picking where you carry stick for hand, they run up and down. Make you collect them from Antirua. Stick feel cause blindness. Stick where picking go for hand. That long long stick where they take play. If it cause blindness. Then our mama them where they carry umbrella, umbrella. This umbrella don't cause a lot of problem for us inside the inside clinic. As that umbrella be where the mouth sharp like that, if you want hold and make you turn the side way sharp for ground, especially when you carry picking for bag, enter Okada, or carry picking for bag, you want to enter Kekena pen. That umbrella make you hold and well. You don't blind a lot of our patients. And once it hits the eye, that eye don't go. So those sharp objects, they cause blindness for inside the mouth for house. Now he make we carry this message, it come. 
make our mama and our papa them make they take care for with the instrument when they are picking the hole. Then when you come for school again, another thing where they cause blindness. We will not see this masset, this masset, this compass where they take inside masset. That compass where one side they sharp, where they take draw circle. That compass and another thing where they cause blindness. If Pekin get compass, maybe they know the whole that compass, the, the master, maybe they know they collect the compass with the inside the whole for hand, or they can be played. If the blind eye, well, well, once you enter the eye, the eye don't blind. If you enter the eye, the blindness be that. So make we help our, our Pekin, maybe they don't get blindness because of the thing where we carry, they carry for hand. So what we are saying is that the compass we have inside our master, our writing material for the children, the pencil, the Bible, they can cause blindness. Then we will be teacher for school, where would they like flog picking? If you want flog picking, no flog them for head. Because as you flog the head, if you hit the eye. And once you hit that eye, what will be that? Now blindness be that too. Most times, now blindness is the result. So make you now be careful with the cable that you take bit picking for head or hand or belts. You will be papa will is a big use belts, take bit picking. Make you no use them for the picking in head. Make the eye no go. Then our women where they like do nyanga, where they do nyanga, make their head they fine, where they plate hair. Eh, eh, make we come closer. Now we get message you want tell you now. Message you want tell you now, strong boy. You see that on a picking comb, what do they call a picking comb? Or comb what they take, cutting comb. Where it's sharp like me, to be like what if you take a chute person. Many, many picking them what I don't see for my clinic here. Yeah. He don't blind them. They could not keep away. Well. Don't allow the picking they can be played. Even comb said when you take comb here. Scissors for house. Make you keep away picking hand no go reach. I take God back on Make you save our picking their eye. Maybe they don't go blind. Those things we'll get for house if it cause blindness. Now here they tell you my country people. Make you not keep away. Well. Make our picking they don't go blind. Now you will be talk. Then those of us where our house find where 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 we put ties ties will be like mirror. You will not see this water we picking that pour for ground. That water fee make person die. Not the only blindness. If he make picking die, many cases of blindness who don't see up now. That water will they pour for ties. So I beg you now, make you no use that kind thing. If the king go back finish your bathroom, make you no carry soap for leg enter that ties you want that day. Sometimes they. That is to carry the heat for ground. And as they fall, if not table they close with their eye heat, what's gonna happen? Now blindness be that. Sometimes if the back of the head, this place will be called the occipital lobe, where they take C. If he knock for ground well, well, that begin if you know that you they begin to go blind, even though don't touch the eye. Because now the brain they see, no be the only the eye they see, brain they follow see. So that one will cause many, many problems for our picking them. So picking way they house, make we use correct things to carry them, we protect them from those things where we blind them. All these things we are talking now, make we keep them very, very well where you supposed to. This one that for picking, I don't talk. Then make we come for our mama and papa them. Now we are in our adults, our daddy and our mommies. Please avoid anything that will make you to punch sometimes when we get angry you go one beat mama you go use slap you go use punch when they enter clinic mama will say that something hit her for eye but we will don't they for eye clinic we will don't treat eye for a long time when we see them we don't already know say that hand hit her yeah? when person way they hit for right eye when they read for left eye when you come we will ask you what happened to your eye once you look the woman, ask her, ah, what happened to your eye? You say, I hit my face on the door. Truly, truly, when you look at the eye, the black ring is already there. And definitely the left eye was captured. Definitely the man will just ask the woman, your husband, is he a right-handed person or a left-handed person? Once you say the man is a right-handed person, you don't catch him. Say, I punch, they punch him for eye. That eye, when they punch, you see that eye, when they punch, the eye, if you go blind, even if so, you don't go chemist, go take uh, gentamicin and chlorophenicol. As you don't take up like that, the eye, if you still go blind, even though the redness and the pain don't go. Because there is something we call trauma induced glaucoma. When there is a trauma in the eye, after some time, that eye builds up pressure. That pressure that it builds up after some time, if it's not well controlled, 
in six months or in a year time, what will happen? There will be what we call trauma-induced glaucoma. Or there might be a complicated cataract that is called what? Traumatic cataract. So that punch will you give for eye. Then another one, if you slap a person for eye, slap mama, slap papa, sometimes mama will slap my papa for eye. Because my mama is slap papa, so don't believe mama is so some people is slap. Maybe we'll keep this in our hands, say it cause blindness for us for clinic. I beg you now, mama and papa then. When you slap somebody strong, very well for eye, you see this part where they call retina, where we take C, where it be like film of camera. Once you slap like that, the thing will peel off from the eye. We call it retinal detachment. When you peel off from the eye like that, now blindness with that, the eye don't go see again. Sometimes when you slap, this lens where it's inside the eye, where you see here now, wait till you happen, it will fall, enter inside this one, where it be like water. Once it don't fall like that, now it will be called lens subluxation. The lens will sublux, wait till you happen, that person don't go see again. So punch and slap for eye, it no good. Then people where they short sighted, anything where they make person slap you for I make you wrong or not. Because on our own, we say on our retina no strong well well from back. Anything where you hit them, that person the retina don't come out. And our blindness with that. Now retina detachment will be called that one. So when there is trauma on the eye and you have redness, pain, photophobia, you cannot see light, you need thorough treatment. It's not just calming the pain down and clearing the redness. The pressure of that eye needs to be monitored for some time. And if the pressure is rising, you control it. Then our adult way they go farm. Now you still talk about it. Anytime where you enter farm, if stick or grass or anything enter your eye, where it cause injury for the eye. That thing they always carry it to what we call fungal infection, enter the eye. For example, people where they farm rice. You see rice. That grass for rice, it will be like an uh, arrow. If you enter the eye, you always perforate the eye well well. What I mean is that the, 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 the leaf of rice, the stem of rice, that the, the leaf is as sharp as arrow. When it gets to the eye, it normally destroys the eye, it causes a lot of injury. So most times farmers, in the course of harvesting those rice, bending down to harvest them, they normally receive a trauma from the grass. That trauma normally causes a lot of perforation to the eyeball. When that perforation comes, it normally causes blindness. So people where they go farm, go farm rice, especially rice, make they carry what you will call goggles, glass, make they take and cover the eye. As you cover the eye very, very well, you don't go allow that grass to really enter the eye. So grass, grass of uh, where it gets sharp edge, if you enter the eye sometimes, it causes blindness. Sometimes fungal problem will do it, it will cause disease, what we call fungal disease for the eye. Most times it's very difficult to treat. So those ones we cause blindness too. When stick way they farm hits your eye, now we we'll too. Because the injury way go bring, it is very difficult to treat. Because what happen, the stick will carry out to what we call fungal infection. It enter the eye. So if we enter farm, don't say your glass now only for house you will wear. And wear an enter farm because it will protect your eye. Or you wear your goggle, protective goggle, take enter the farm. It will help you. Then our papa and mama, the way they drive machine, drive or car, drive car. If you the drive machine and insects where they fly past, if that insect hits the eye, sometimes the wings, the wing of the insect, if you enter the eye, will trap for the cornea. So this cornea be like gum where it magnet anything. If sand enter, it will go for the cornea. And once it gum there enter, it will cause wahala. So when you there on top machine or you drive your car where you wind down, if a person make you carry your sunshade, take over the eye. Use your glasses when you are driving, it will protect your eye. When you are on the bike, oncoming bed, some bed that is crossing across, that is flying across, when you hit that bed with a high velocity while you are driving, if it is the eye that the bed meets, most times that eye normally gets a lot of injury. Those injuries, some of them, when if not well managed, can cause blindness. So when you are driving, you are on the bike, use your glasses. Sometimes even the stone from the bike, some other, another car can pass and climb on the stone. Those tiny pebbles can go straight to the eye. If it gets to the eye with that speed, it can cause blindness too. Wearing our protective glasses when we are driving bike, driving car, 
can lead to a lot of protection. So in summary of all the things we have been saying is that to prevent common cause of blindness at home, we must take a lot of precaution. Number one precaution that the children should be guided, especially when they are given writing materials like pencils and biro. Some of those pencils and biros can cause blindness when the child eye lands on them. So if we can do all this, then keep away sharp objects away so that they will not cause problems. And then general, finally, if our adults can protect their eye when they are going to farm, when they are driving bike or car, they will prevent blindness from occurring. So we are begging you to take this precaution so that we reduce the rate of traumatic cause of blindness in our environment. Please, if you have enjoyed this video, I will advise, I will beg, I will clamor for you to do what? To subscribe and then share so that our people will get this message. Then also share it. Also like and subscribe and then give us thumb up. Then comment. I want to see your comments. If, you are, if there is anything you want us to talk more about or questions that you have, I am ready to answer any question concerning your eye. Under the comment section, please, you can type your questions. We are going to answer. I'm going to answer the question very well. Thank you for listening. Thank you for listening. Please share. My country people, wait till I talk for I talk for English now. Now, we say, make una put hand for the subscribe button. Make una share around. Make una scatter and make una spread and make you go everywhere. So that country man and country woman go hear this message go be talk. Make una know get blindness from our society. We could not do everything we are doing. For. Make God bless you as you are listening. Thank you very, very much.